this problem, there's a person, Karen, taking a survey in one middle school about her favorite band. Of the 1,156 students in the school, so this many students in middle school, 65 sixth grade students were surveyed. So she tried to represent this big group of students with a little group of 65 sixth grade students. That's the goal here. Because what did she want to know? Let's read on. She wanted to know, well, she stated that most middle school students' favorite band is Rhonda and the Geese. Now, it says here, why is the statement incorrect? Well, let's think about what she was doing. She was saying, if I ask this small group of sixth graders what band they like, that'll give me a really good idea of what all 1,156 middle school students, which includes sixth, seventh and eighth grade students like. Right, that's the goal in a survey because you don't want to ask everybody but you want to find a representative group, a group that represents everybody. So she certainly did not pick too many students. In fact, I would say she picked too little. And here it says Karen's survey sample was too small, so that's a possibility. Karen did not survey any high school students. Well, if she wanted to know, she said that most middle school students' favorite band is Rana and the Geese. Why would she survey high school students. That's a different uh, group of students altogether. Karen did not include enough bands in the survey. That could be a mistake, but we don't even know what band sh bands she offered in the survey. So how can we even respond to that one? So I would say the answer that makes the most sense here is G, because how could a small group of just sixth grade students represent the entire middle school? All right, hope that helps.